What's going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is Wacky Cat. You can call me Cat. And here I'm going to talk about the Woozer Vest 3. And I've had it for over a year now. So I'm just going to give you an update video of how I'm feeling about the vest. Am I still wearing the vest? Because, you know, the honeymoon phase is gone now. So uh, some of you have been asking. You've seen my other videos about the Woozer Vest. Uh, how do I feel about movies? And I'm just going to shoot straight from the hip. Uh, as, instead of making a lot of cut scenes over here and there, I'm just going to tell you like it is. First of all, I want to say the Woozer Vest is innovative. And what if you haven't seen any of my videos talking about the vest, basically haptic feedback. And what that means is it's a subwoofers, if you will, these little round things. Some got a few in my back on the side and you feel the base of whatever you're listening to, whatever you're playing. You can use you can use this with video games. You can use it with movies or you can connect it to your iPad. It, it got Bluetooth. So, hey, it's a all around gadget here now for me personally and this is just all my opinion about it uh i just strictly use it for gaming now you can use it for movies uh, i listen uh, now I, the only movies genre that i do put this vest on is horror movies uh because i'm gonna get to that the reason why um and then music i when i first got it I was listening to music. This is perfect for music. You can kind of put your, your, your earbuds your, in, your, your headphones, connect it, and have a workout. And that's a whole new vibe. Kind of rare for me to do that. So movies, video games, more on the video game side. Now with the Woozer Vest, um, I'm still wearing it. But here's the thing. I'm not wearing it every single time I play video games. Uh, with with video games and movies, there's a leisure, if you ask me, a leisure element of it, of me just relaxing from a long day. I just want to relax. I don't. I just want to watch the TV. I don't want to feel vibrations and all that. So there's a most of the time, a lot of the time, I am just chilling with no vest on. But if you really want to get immersed into a situation, like you're ready to, you want to feel what you're watching, to feel the game, then I put it on. So I put this on ever so often uh, when I particular games Starfield I put this on and it, it, it with these headphones right here these steel steel series headphones it, it really makes a difference you kind of got to find your sweet spot with different aspects you got to kind of play around with the video game you're messing with in my experience or the movie because you see these little dials right here they are determining how high you're going to hear the sounds in your headphones and how much haptic feedback are you going to feel from these these subwoofers here these little side things on the back so the it goes by the sounds in the movie the sounds in the video game so you kind of want it not to be too loud by, you don't want to, I, I, in my opinion, you can do what you want, but in my opinion, I don't turn it all the way up, the subwoofer part, because I don't want to feel, because this thing will constantly shake. You kind of got to find where, what particular movie is this going to shake here? Is it too much? How much, how often does this particular video game play music? Now, with Starfield, I had to go in the settings and actually for the Fuja Res, I had to turn the music down because the music in Starfield in that particular game is kind of the same volume as the actual sound effects. So when the sounds of the bass of the, you don't want to let the music of whatever you're watching interfere with the sound effects. This is honestly, in my opinion, this is for the sound effects, so the feel, room, the, the revering of the car. You don't want to hear the background because you, the background music is just the background music. You don't want to hear the background music. You want to hear the sound effects, the the slashing, the the, the gunshots, the 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 revering up, the, the the stuff like that. That what you want to hear. So you kind of got to, in some instances, play with settings in different video games. Now with movies, you you really you really don't have much of a choice. But action movies, this is key. This is good for it. For horror movies, this is good because horror movies, 
the jump scares of the sounds of the music is perfect for this vest. Now, any other movie genre, a comedy, uh, a, 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 a romance movie, uh, this is just, if you ask me, this is just for action movies and for, obviously, scary movies. And it, it's, it's great. But with the same, with the game, I don't put this on every time, but then when I want to get immersed, solo watching it by myself with the movie, if I don't have anyone else watching, I'll put this on. But if you're with your friends, family, then it's kind of, kind of, you're not, obviously, you're going to be the only one hearing it. Uh, this thing can connect to you. a lot of smart TVs, OLED TVs. It can connect to TVs. It can connect uh, through different devices. Uh, the learning curve still is trying to figure out, uh, a lot of people are trying to figure out, which do I go with? Do I go with uh, wireless headset or do I go with wired headset in my experience I believe that the wired headsets work a little bit better with me with the Woozer vest so in other words I connect the Woozer vest to whatever I'm watching and then connect instead of you know the other way around um, a lot of people are still trying to find what's the sweet spot with that but this is just my opinion on the situation uh, now is the Woozer vest worth it now I wish and it may get to a certain point because since the Woozer Vest now is in uh, Best Buy now, you can go pick this up at Best Buy now. At first, you can only go on the website and pick it up. I, I'm i hoping that, and this will be a good idea, that Woozer somehow gets vendors or somebody to have a stand or to test this out. Because this is, it is got a high price range to buy something you don't really know what it's going to do. This is new technology. Uh, so you really don't know exactly what you're going to get. You're kind of like, well, I don't know how this thing feels. I don't know. I don't know exactly. I'm going to spend this much money on this, and I don't know what's going on here. Uh, so word of mouth is basically going to drive up the the uh, curiosity. Now, due to the fact that it is in a retail store like Best Buy, that's going to drive up the curiosity because now people can just pick it up and uh, just buy it straight from the store and test it out. And if they don't like it, I guess they can take it back. But uh, I've been loving my vest. I think it's uh, it's worth it if you, it depends on what type of person you are. Do you want to be, like I said, some people will put this vest on every time. I've heard people in my comment section say they put this thing on every five minutes. They, they can't play a video game without this vest on. They can't watch a movie without this vest. They can't listen to music around the house without this vest. Uh, uh, I heard some people even work out with this vest on. With, have your Bluetooth, have your, uh, your Beats by Dre headset on, working out, walking around. It's, it's perfect and i see the new accessories they got with this vest the hanger the chest so it can me i guess be more tighter fit so now vr technology this is perfect for vr now i got a meta quest 2 uh, i'm thinking about getting a playstation vr 2 so that's perfect for this vest too this is the, the, the and, I, and i tried a little vr with it now vr is with this vest is absolutely amazing. This is, when it comes to VR, this is where it's at. You want, this vest is perfect. You got, you can't, I mean, you're talking about being immersed, especially with, uh, with the VR PlayStation 2 headset. Um, they got haptic feedback and vibration with the actual headset. So I haven't tried that out. So I can, I'm thinking about getting one of those and see and testing it out. And if I do test it out, I'm sure it will be uh, posted it on my channel now do I recommend this product yes I recommend this product um, it, it's great but like I said I don't wear this every single time I it's not it, the honeymoon phase is over I when the honeymoon phase when I first got it I was wearing it every five minutes but then it kind of twinkle off like okay I just want to relax now I just want to chill and watch a movie I don't want to be feeling vibrations or every time somebody get you know shaking and all that i don't want to feel the vibration when i'm playing a game i don't want to feel the vibration so it's not as often as i thought i would put it on but i do put it on 
when I do like okay I'm ready to uh, I want to f- I actually feel like I'm in this movie I actually want to feel like I'm in this game now you put the best on but you gotta play around with the dials to figure out wait a minute this is too loud I'm hearing music the music the little rumbling of the music and it does a great job of if you can put it in the setting you like and the dials you like then you can not hear the music and just hear the sound effects and which I think is great. I'm glad they put these dials on. So yeah, the Wooja Vest is the future technology. I believe uh, they can keep building on it, make it better and better and better. And uh, it will be something that will be a household name. It's, it's actually growing and growing. A lot of people are being more curious about it. So yeah. So anyway, I'm Wacky Cat. Make sure you like the video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching. And I'm out.